All may have been taken by Indira, but all the nitty gritty was worked out by Sanjay, and he made clear that there were no dissent would be allowed within the Congress. Justice Jagmohan Lal Sinha's uh, judgment had a major impact and ripples were felt throughout the country because what the judgment effectively did was to disbar Indira Gandhi as an MP. That meant her position as a prime minister of the country became in doubt unless the Supreme Court overturned the High Court judgment. Uh, the Congress, her own colleagues, were secretly gleeful because they thought this was their opportunity to stake a claim for the Prime Minister's slot. The opposition thought that they were part of the JP bandwagon which was crusading against corruption and they felt this was a moral victory for them. So Indira felt very threatened on all sides. As my book brings out, in fact, the plan to introduce an internal emergency had been taken as early as January that year. But obviously, when she felt her position in threat, she put the, decided to put the plan into action and spearheading her defense and advising her was her son, Sanjay Gandhi. He was, the call may have been taken by Indira, but all the nitty gritty was worked out by Sanjay because in the uh, time between the 12th and 26th when the uh, emergency was imposed, Sanjay got his uh, gang of uh, uh, supporters to arrange a whole series of uh, uh, meetings, rallies to show their support for uh, Indira Gandhi and he made clear that there were no dissent would be allowed within the Congress. And within a short time, the Congress Parliamentary Party called a meeting and it was made clear that despite the judgment, she continued to be the Prime Minister of the country.